Yo, what's up guys? Today, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be going through some of the replays from the RLCS live event. Um, I'm going to try to do at least one game, maybe two, it depends on some series, but at least one game from each series. Alright, so, see this is day one, I think it was this game that was the most interesting. So yeah, it was us up against... Northern Gaming on day one. I'm gonna mostly watch from my POV, and if something happens, we can look at other POVs and just kind of go off of it. We have a pretty good kickoff there. I'm able to pop it over Turbo. Nothing too interesting yet. Garrett gets dunked, but we still have possession. Good touch by Garrett, and Devo kills it. Let's see, we're keeping possession. That was a good pass by Fire, but I missed the goal. Okay, I really should have scored there. Alright. So let's watch again from a fly. The ball's over in the corner and they have two people in the corner and Turbo's just kind of like staying still and goal. He doesn't really have too much to do. That's one of like the easier shots I could have made. So let's, uh, let's just watch it again. But if we go back to here in slow-mo, Devo's already flipped at the ball and Remco's like falling onto the wall. So, it's pretty obvious that Fire is going to at least get a touch. It wasn't quite the touch that you would expect. But, like, I don't know. I should have been able to make that shot 10 times out of 10. I just hit it high. I guess the nerves were getting to me. It was good that Garrett was there to follow, though. We ended up scoring anyway, even though I have, like, an atrocious shot. We just kind of cut them out on defense there. Wasn't too much that they could do after they got stuck in the corner together. So we win the kickoff again. Probably not too much happening right off a of kickoff. Devo just tries to play it wide. Gets the dunk. Gary gets the block there as well. Um, actually, it wasn't that good. Hold on, let's slow it down. It wasn't that good for me to challenge there. So if we look, after, after Garrett's dunk right now, we have... Rimko out of play, Devo opposite side of the field, and Turbo's just sitting there. I could have taken it slower or slammed it off the wall to give Fireburner a pass. Because Fire's coming in for a pass. Turbo's below me, he won't be able to do anything if I hit the ball hard, and Devo's still in goal. So if I hit the ball straight, like at this wall right here, where the ball is, it's going to bounce middle where Fireburner is trying to drive already. But because I hit it so soft, we don't really get a play out of that at all. They end up countering off of it as well. They, they had a pretty good chance to score there, honestly, but Fire and Garrett are both insane on defense, so it doesn't matter too much. That was actually a really good save. Let's go back. Oh, man, I'm so bad with camera controls. I'm sorry, guys. All right. So Turbo hits it wide, and it gives me time to play the ball up on my own. But I see Fire burner middle, so I hit it downwards. Turbo gets like a really good block on the wall though. That's one of the plays like you have to call with your teammates as well. So I told Fire I was going to get down and he was ready for it. Let's see? Oh, I think they counter off of this as well. Okay. So that counter was because like we messed up our opportunity to go there. So if we go back to none. Me and Firebender are both like on this side of the field now, and I'm recovering, getting boost, and he's coming back instantly. Garrett gets gets beat like on the wall challenge, but he turns around, or gets beat a second time, and Fire has like a bad touch to the wall. Doesn't set up too much. So if you look while Fire's in the corner, it's like him, Devo, Rimko all near the ball, and Devo turns to go for the ball. And Fire has to like try to block his dribble, because we're actually, like while we were playing, we were really scared. Of Devo dribbles. Devo's like a really good 1v1 player. And we're afraid of it most of the time. So after that fired bad touch, it's not too big of a deal, but they have three players closer to the ball than like any of us. So I have to try to recover it. And Rimko tries to bump me as well. I end up hit okay. Let's take it let's take a moment to appreciate that actually. But yeah, I end up bumping him. But because I slow down, I can't get up to Turbo's ball fast enough. 
It was just like a pretty simple counter attack from them. It's the main reason that we got scored on. There's still four minutes left in the game. Like, anything could have happened at this point. All these games are, like, super close. Fire hits the ball up. I actually should have scored there as well. They gave me a lot of space to play with that. So if you look... I see fire. I know that he's hitting it up. And right here... I'm close to the ball. Devo's super late. Turbo's down there. And Rimko's still getting boost. It was a wide open net that I just completely missed. And then fire couldn't catch up to it either. So right there, it probably should have been 2-1 already, honestly. There are a lot of missed chances by both teams in this game, though. Good pass by Fire, and I completely beat it. Okay, you guys will see this a lot. I played really bad this series. There are a lot of chances like this. Let's slow it down. Fire hits it off... Okay, I didn't slow it down at all. Fire hits it off the wall, I just miss. I end up faking one, and like... Oh no, it was a bad bounce off the post, and Garrett couldn't really read it. It's really unfortunate. We could have scored there again as well, but we just weren't really playing well. Especially me. Garrett was playing really well today, though. See, fire hits it. This is something me and Fire do a lot. We have like a bunch of touches back and forth. I tried to hit it off the back, but... Rimko was actually really quick to this. Now let's get back up to that point. I might have went back a little bit too far, but we'll get there. Alright. So let's go fly. Fire. I see fire going up and I try to hit the ball back to him. He's able to hit it back to me one more time before Devo or Turbo can get it. So at that point we beat two of them to the ball. Turbo is still recovering and Garrett's coming in for the shot. So a lot of the time this would be like a really good play. But Rimko got a nice read off the bounce and he's able to clear it and Garrett has to wait as well now. See. They have a little bit of a counter attack here, but me and Garrett are both back. Nothing too important could have happened there. Unless they put off a really nice play. Oh, I got in Garrett's way and just completely destroy him right there. I'm pretty sure this is a team play between Fire and Garrett. I don't think I'm part of this goal at all. At all. Oh, never mind. Garrett's just insane. Okay. Let's go back. Let's watch that from a... Uh, yeah, Fireburner's point of view. Right, we'll have to go back a little bit more. So Fire comes up. I almost run back into him again. He just hits it off the wall, like hoping for the best. He does it twice. He went there to bump Rimko. That's actually really important. We can go to uh, Garrett now. Because Rimko is still kind of recovering from the jump, and he couldn't get up to the ball that quickly. So by the time Garrett sees that Devo gets like a bad touch on the ball. Devo and Turbo are both on the right side of the field and Rimko is the only one left in goal. If he took like a regular shot, Rimko would have had a really good chance to save it. It was like a really good decision by him to go for a double touch there. There's no more goals this game, but there are like a lot of um, a lot of opportunities from both teams that were just barely missed. That was a good boom by fire, but I didn't think it was going straight down, so I didn't really commit. We were trying to play more passive in this tournament just because it's like showed a lot of success from other teams playing passive. It worked for us the first day, but not so much the second. Not too much, just a little bit of a cluster fuck in the corner. People trying to dunk each other, trying to gain possession. Pretty weak touch by Turbo. But I didn't really follow up on it too well either. Garrett. Oh, that was, uh, that was unfortunate there again. So we go back. Let's just do a, a flyby for this. Firebrenner takes the ball off Turbo there. Devo goes for the challenge. So Devo's out of the play. Turbo's out of the play. Garrett has possession and Burner. It's the demo of his life right there. That's like the third easy goal that we've missed already. There's still two minutes left in the game.
Yeah, I tried to demo Rimkill there. It would have relieved pressure, because D.Va would have been alone on the attack, but... We didn't really get pressured anyway. Garrett killed the attack early. I'm alone there and... Okay, that was a really good touch. If you slow it down... Fuck. So if we slow that down... You have Rimko and Devo coming for the counterattack because Garrett and Fire both went up. So Rimko gets the pass from to Devo, and I'm just recovering, trying to hope that he doesn't hit it far post. I hit the post ball right after it bounces, so I'm able to get it clear, like without turning around and without losing any time. It would have been like really dangerous for us to try to make a play there, like unless I got a really good touch like that. It would have been two on one with me in defense, and Garrett and Firebrand are still recovering. So that touch was really important to keep us up. We're just kind of keeping possession now. There's only a minute left. A minute is like a lot of time in Rocket League, but it's not too much time to score like four or five goals. But we know that we can hold them with just a one goal lead if we needed. Let's see. I think I missed that. No, I didn't. There's a lot of just like passive giving up possession, giving possession back between the teams in this game for some reason. We gave each other like a lot of space. And usually that's something that both of our teams do well with, but ne no one was really taking advantage of it. So here, Garrett, Garrett got demoed. We'll, we'll just watch it out at first. We'll watch it. That's a really good save by Garrett. Okay, so let's watch it out. From where Garrett got demoed. I think that's coming up right after this. Yeah. Alright. So we go fly. I'm coming back. Fire is just on attack, so he's coming back as well. And Garrett gets demoed. So I have to make a beeline to the goal and hope for the best right here. Devo tried to pop it to get a pass from Rimko, and I'm able to read it. And then Fire actually gets a good touch out. If you look at our rotations, we're all spread out. The only real problem right now is that me and Garrett are both on the wall. But I realize that and I end up coming down. Firebrenner is trying to challenge that first ball. And he just gets beat to it, so. See, Garrett's touch there. I try to read him and go for the ball. I came for the corner boost because I thought he was going to hit it wide. And I can't actually beat Rimko to the ball. I was actually like really lucky that Garrett got a block there. We probably should have been scored on. See. 20 seconds left and I take their boost if there was like any less time than 20 seconds taking the other team's boost is usually like a really bad idea especially with only a one goal lead here I go missing the ball again but the ball ends up dying afterwards um, overall this was like a really sloppy series for like bo both us and northern gaming for some reason like neither of the teams played too well in the series but we just somehow you know, we came out on top somehow. I'm going to keep doing these. I'm going to try to do it for like the other series, both day one and day two that we played in at least. If you guys have like any suggestions about what I can do better, or like different ways to do this, just let me know. I'll be sure to do it. Peace, guys.